just beautiful Chesapeake Bay so quiet I'm hearing birds and <laughs> crickets and stuff it's ridiculous I love it welcome to MCC just motos hey guys Andy from MCC just motos I got my buddy Bob he's gonna be riding my live wire I'm gonna ride my he's never been on a live wire at Del Mar um, yeah first time so all you got to do is hit the start button and raise the kickstand and the bike's on man I'll tell you what I'm gonna do a quick spin around in the in the woods here and then I'll meet you right back here and you can follow me all right cool all right well, I'll max my Himalayan it's actually the second time I've been riding together with the uh, live wire Whew. need to clean up a little after after a big uh, rally I went to but all right all right <laughs> little slop sloppy wet oh yeah but it's always good to get in a little <laughs> There he goes. <laughs> you good? All right, let's go. All right. I guess, uh, again, I don't mind uh, buddies taking uh, rides with me on my bikes. I mean, I think that's what motorcycles are for, right? <laughs> low gas but still plenty to go all right weird right I know you're trying to trying to downshift or hit the clutch right <laughs> yeah a little uh, little different <laughs> <laughs> and you can hear everything it's really I know, it's really eerie, like. I know you can talk to I can't tell you how many people talk to me just you know on the you know at a stoplight it's just something you're not used to <laughs> yeah. oh. oh wrong gear that doesn't happen on a live wire <laughs> can't really stall it out How's the comfort so far? It's, it's pretty tall, right? Yeah. All right, here we go. We'll just take a slow out of here. All right, success. All right. Just going for a little uh, spin. It did rain yesterday, and uh, you can see the remnants of it. Um, I just made a post, and this is pretty funny, about phantom clutching, phantom downshifting, riding from an ice bike, internal combustion engine, to a live wire or a EV bike. And I can't tell you, for someone who has both motorcycles, almost every time I get on, I phantom will hit the clutch or try and downshift when, when, uh, when I'm coming to a stop or something. <laughs> it's really nimble, right? It's a lot different than the live wire one. Yeah, it's, it's it's taller, it's more comfy for me, um, and it's not as heavy. It's not as, it's not quite a solid feeling on the ground, but it's a lot more nimble. Yeah. And I love the style, man. Look at that bike. Have you done two up on it? Uh, I haven't yet. I haven't. All right, here we go. day before Thanksgiving gobble gobble and I've been jonesing to get a uh, to get a ride in so uh, the weather
weather supports it. It's some 50 some degrees out. Beautiful day. On a motorcycle, you can't beat that. You know, all right, let's use this video to talk about what it's like to jump back and forth between uh, an internal combustion motorcycle and a electric vehicle or EV motorcycle. Um, less range anxiety with a, with a gas bike just because you can always fill up. So that's not in your head as much. You're like, oh, I need gas, I'll just go find something. That's, that's really cool. Um, obviously you have a lot of performance differences between the motorcycles and you have a little bit of weight difference. Uh, gas bikes are a little less weighty. Again, it's louder and the motor is part of the ride experience where if on an electric vehicle, the motor is not. So the ride experience becomes more out there than right in here. Still, still just different experiences. In fact, I may make him jump on this one and I'm gonna jump on that one. I do really, really, really dig this Himalayan. It is at the performance level that I've wanted it to be for such a long time. <laughs> this is where all that torque on the live wire gets can be a little scary, just because uh, all the leaves can make you spin out a little. So we'll just take it nice and easy. Both are very, very much at home with these low speed neighborhood drives. One's a little more quiet than the other, I'll say that. Oh, is it just gorgeous out? All these fall leaf colors, even after the rain, is really cool. Well, all right, let's talk about Thanksgiving. Um, you know, uh, I gotta say, Thanksgiving is probably my favorite holiday. Just cause, uh, just because you're with family and friends and that's really the focus on everything. Uh, so I really, really, really love Thanksgiving. And the colors are there, the smells are there. It's the holiday that I think like you associate most with like smells, sights, sounds, and feelings. You know, maybe Christmas is like right there as well too. If you celebrate Christmas. But again, um Thanksgiving I think kinda everybody celebrates, so Let's go down there and take a picture. Okay. <laughs> oh. All right, I'm gonna get a picture, stop the video and get a little picture. Very cool. I don't know yet. <laughs> I'm gonna look. <laughs> look at that bike, it's so quiet. Perfect, perfect. Yeah, it's pretty easy to move around. <laughs> yeah, it sure is. Okay. Man. What what Yeah man. You know what? You're gonna have to get the picture. <laughs> well, actually, let's see, hold on. Head back. Uh, you want to try the Himalayan? You want to keep riding that guy? Uh, I'll switch if you want. Yeah. Up to you? Okay. Yeah. Why don't you do that? I'll, I'll, I'll grab the keys. <laughs> cool. All right. Cool. All right. There you go. High compression or I don't know. 
bad battery. One of those two. <laughs> All right, here we go. And I'm back on the live wire. A little gravel. At least I can always hear where he's at. Yeah, <laughs> this is just as easy to drive slow, if not easier. Um, the throttle control on this is so nice. All right, <laughs> it's just so easy. Not gonna get any awkward situations where you'd have to worry about stalling out. Yeah, I am going to keep it on rain mode. Not because it's rainy, but because the leaves are so darn slippery. Alright. Yep, phantom clutch. I already hit it. <laughs> Oops. And phantom downshift. Just beautiful Chesapeake Bay. So quiet. I'm hearing birds and <laughs> crickets and stuff. It's ridiculous. I love it. Man, it's just you're hearing the leaves, you're hearing the rocks, you're hearing the tires, everything. Again, your focus is so much more turned into out there instead of like on your motorcycle just because motor you're not hearing it I'm actually hearing the leaves rustle even though they're wet I hear the the wetness of the tires <laughs> the sticks crunching the proportions of this motorcycle are really nice just it feels like it fits and made for me that's what you want to hear on a on a bike, right? Where maybe on some of the other motorcycles, such as my Himalayan or my, my Pan America, um, I've had to create some of the ergonomics to fit me better. This one seemed to fit really nice. How do you like this one? Very cool motors, man. I know, right? <laughs> Very cool. All right. <laughs> the wind becomes a part of your routine. Much more than it's the dominant noise you hear at higher speeds. It's just the wind rush it speaks to you. Such a different experience. You can hear the little bit whine of the motor. Play uh, solemn, leaf solemn. <laughs> If you're a motorcycle rider, you know what I'm talking about. Where there's really no reason to go in and outside of the leaves. It's just fun to do it, so you do it anyway. Leaf slalom. It's so weird how both motorcycles fit me so well, but they're so different. They're connected in different ways. Who would have thought this one would feel this way? And I... I'm enjoying a nice crisp fall day. Guys, this is this is great. My Thanksgiving ride, my Thanksgiving thoughts, the differences between electric motorcycle riding and EV motorcycle riding and going back and forth, the phantom clutch downshifts, the phantom clutch pulls, what it's like to drive and how both bikes are so good and they fit differently, but they're uh they're both great. <laughs> you enjoying that one? <laughs> yeah. It kind of does, right? It really does have that sportster feel, right? <laughs> yep, has a little bit of torque down low, and yeah, yeah. <laughs> oh man, yeah. 
guys, that's gonna do it for me. This was a great Thanksgiving ride, just a quick jaunt. Hopefully you guys enjoyed coming along with me here, my my day-to-day -day thoughts. Not maybe super deep, but uh, just kind of my daily thoughts, and I gotta go for a motorcycle ride. Hopefully you guys get out to this Thanksgiving weekend. We'll catch you on the next episode. Thanks for watching, please like and subscribe.